So Sarah was late for an interview, not very late, but she was sanctioned. She was late because there was an accident on the road and the bus she was on was stuck in traffic. It wasn't her fault. What is she to learn from that? Uh, another constituent was told that she had to come for an interview at the job centre. She was given a week's notice and they said, we want you to come next Wednesday at 3pm. And she said, oh, but I pick up my six-year-old from school at 3pm. Well, that's just tough. Her parents lived 100 miles away. That's just tough. You either come to the interview or we sanction your benefits. What was she to learn from that? Abandon the child at the school playground or take the child out of school, which is what she did do, and that child missed an hour's education. I have a constituent in Royston Hill, a couple. Um, the wife went into labour, um, having a baby, not the party. Um, and, I don't know why I said that. <laughs> the wife went into labour and he, the husband unsurprisingly went with her. He had no credit to phone and say that he wouldn't be signing on that day, so he went the next day. Six weeks they were sanctioned for. Welcome to the world, tiny baby. Your parents are getting no money for six weeks and not even a single milk token. What is that couple to learn from that sanction? that he should have abandoned his wife and left her to it. And before anyone starts thinking, you know, these are long-term unemployed, blah, 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 blah. This couple, their daughter's two, and they're both working now. They were both working up until six months before she had the baby. They were not people who didn't want to work. And they learned nothing from that except that the government doesn't actually care about them. I have a constituent now who has mental health problems and a visual impairment. He has severe panic attacks. A condition of his ESA is that he attends um, an office in the city centre, it's either once a month or once a week, whatever. It takes him hours, he gets lost, he gets distressed. And, and it, he was asked, what is it you do when you get there? And he said, well, I just sign a bit of paper and leave. Why? What is the point in that? 